Hello everyone, and welcome to my sister wives bombshell channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. This week saw the release of the Sister Wives season 19 trailer, which gave fans a look at Cody, 55, and Robin's present dynamic. The news follows the recent departures of his three wives, Janelle, 55, Christine, 52, and Mary, 53. I feel like the idiot who got left behind, 45-year-old Robin admitted in front of cameras. A close source of the TLC family revealed details about what's purportedly going on behind closed doors in an exclusive interview with the US Sun. Cody and Robin's situation is not good. They haven't been happy at all. The source asserted, I mean, they've been unhappy since everything fell apart, but even more so now, and it's getting worse. It's said that a major factor in their relationship's breakdown is Cody's angry nature. He's simply quite angry with the world at the moment. The person went on, he's not at all who he used to be. He's entirely different now. He is erratic, irascible, and hostile toward everyone who does not revere him. Additionally, the insider stated that Robin has become submissive because to Cody's very controlling behavior. According to the insider, Robin is no longer as gregarious, she used to visit friends and have lengthy phone conversations. In the teaser, Robin and Cody could be seen fighting outside in the snow. Robin informed Cody, I'm having a hard time feeling like, I, am losing respect for you, as she was about to cry. Robin, I can't even get it straight with you right now, yelled Cody in response. After 14 years of dating, the relationship has grown so terrible that the insider thinks Cody is, turning into her ex, David Preston Jessup. Robin, could definitely leave according to them, if things keep going the way they do. If things don't improve, Robin won't be remaining. It has simply come down to that. This kind of control is not sustainable in a marriage, the insider asserted. She will not allow her children to grow up in the same unstable, hostile environment that her previous children did. Cody is becoming more and more like David. She removed her children from him and removed his authority as a parent. Do you believe she will remain for this? No, they continued. The insider explained that Robin fell in love with the man who took care of his family, and that there was so much love in their early connection. Robin was married to David from 1999 to 2007, the latter of whom is currently battling chronic myeloid leukemia. They welcomed Brianna, 19, Aurora, 22, and Dayton, 24, together. After becoming officially married to Robin in 2014, Cody adopted the three children. He then went on to have two children of his own, Ariella, age 8, and Solomon, age 12. She is dependent on Cody for financial support, and her children are still little. Given that Cody has pulled her away from her business ventures, the source asserted that it would be difficult to end the marriage at this time. Robin used to own the My Sister Wife's Closet online store, but it hasn't been up for business in a while. The insider continued, to be honest, the kids and money are keeping her in the marriage. The clip from the new season showed that Cody's arguments with Mary and Janelle had reached a record low. Living in Utah today, Mary declared that she and her former partner were officially done. Janelle said, Cody and I have officially stated that it's not working, in the interim. For her part, Christine introduced the family to David Woolley, her now husband. Christine thrusts her joy in front of everyone. The source told the US Sun, she's like little Miss Sunshine and life is perfect and everyone is drawn to her still. David finds it somewhat annoying, especially since Janelle is Christine's best friend and rides the joyful train. Janelle, who lost her son Garrison in March, even threatened to lawyer up, saying Cody hadn't discussed her Coyote Pass acreage with her. However, construction hasn't begun on the property. Supporters of Sister Wives are responding to Robin Brown's moniker for her alter ego. Fans find the name in the book Becoming Sister Wives, which she discussed, to be quite offensive. Here are the TLC star's comments regarding her alter identity and the reasoning behind her name choice. 
A screenshot of Robin Brown talking about her alter persona from becoming sister wives was shared on Reddit by a user. Robin stated in the passage that she eventually came to the conclusion that the only person she could really rely on was herself. She created an alter ego to serve as her guardian after realizing that. Shira was her name, and she stood for the stronger, more audacious side, the author wrote. I turned a piece of myself into my own superhero because no one would save me. Robin claimed that, Shira, shielded her most vulnerable aspects. Her alter ego also assisted her in building barriers to keep others away from her. Her intention was to never again fall for someone else's deception. The original poster of the Reddit article said, Ah, I finally get why Cody and Robin's house is called the Shira Chateau. Fans of sister wives from around the world were quick to weigh in on the embarrassing passage. One user laughed in the comments, saying, Shira is so powerful that she just crumbles into tears at any perceived criticism. I think this is the cringiest thing I've ever read in my life, commented a second sister wives admirer. A third said they felt second-hand embarrassment for Robin and agreed. Robin, is Shira in the room with us? A fifth individual said, you couldn't waterboard this information out of me, as a fourth person made a joke. Robin appears to have a victim mentality, even in this passage from the book, as one person noted. She declared that nobody would help her. But as some commenters have pointed out, she has been saved quite a few times. Robin received approximately $30,000 from her ex-husband's family to settle her debt. Then, she married Cody Brown and became a member of the Sister Wives cast barely a year after their breakup. 2010 saw the spiritual marriage of Cody and Robin. As she became Cody's fourth wife and a member of the Brown family, Sister Wives viewers watched. In the end, he got a formal divorce from Mary Brown in order to lawfully marry Robin. The family really began to fall apart after that. The other wives were not given as much attention as Robin's kids and Cody's bond with her. Fans wonder where Shira was when Robin would frequently arrive to a confessional on the TLC show with crocodile tears in her eyes. Ever since the end of season 15 of Sister Wives, Cody Brown has been the irascible, polygamous father who seems to be perpetually unlucky. The first three spouses were throwaways, in Cody's opinion, because they finally developed independent thoughts. The most of his adult children don't get along with the father of 18. If that wasn't a serious enough warning sign, Robin Brown is also beginning to doubt her spouse. Cody's resentment has persisted throughout the seasons. The citizen of Arizona is now trying to place the blame elsewhere, even on David Woolley, Christine Brown's new husband. The teaser for season 19 featured Cody having to confront the man Christine chose to replace him. Since he began dating the Sister Wives star, David has no longer been an angel. To be honest, he has occasionally been a bit of an instigator. In a funny post, Christine and David made fun of Cody for his comment about nachos. Readers will remember that Cody expressed his displeasure with Christine's snack-eating behavior in the Brown family book. In retaliation for Cody calling his wife a princess after he labeled her sluggish, David has also started referring to his wife as queen. However, David comes across as a kind man who isn't searching for trouble. The meeting of the mind seems to me to be a little more reserved. I find it hard to believe Cody would humiliate himself in front of another man. Like a true reality star, he'll probably start off nice and then smack the cameras during his confessional. I don't think it's the family's fault that they felt more comfortable with David. Robin felt a bit like the mistress when she suddenly appeared in the household in 2010. Cody preached about his stringent courtship regulations. Until they were married, he wouldn't kiss the women, have sex with them, or stay with them. However, Cody broke nearly all of his own rules in the first season of Sister Wives. Throughout their romantic involvement, the father was seen on video kissing Robin several times. The wives were furious that they hadn't even been warned as they re-watched the video. When Christine went into labor, Cody was also spending time with Robin, who was hours away. Neither the family nor the audience have overlooked how self-centered that choice was. Cody's wife was nine months pregnant, and at the time, he would have preferred to be playing the part of a high school student in love. 
The icing on the cake was Cody's involvement in Robin's wedding dress selection. He hadn't acted in that way toward any of his prior spouses. Thus, Robin dug a grave for herself from the very beginning. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any update.